What's up, to the City? Robbie C is the place to be. Doing a little cut on some eggs. They are due to be hatching on September 3rd. We're gonna cut them open early because with my uh, other main businesses, it's hard for me to take the time out and I saw one that looked like it was dead and they're probably ready to cut. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. And what the pairing was is a vanilla Enchi uh, BPI Exantic male and I put him to try to prove out my uh, possible het BPI possible pied and she is a leopard. So crazy story for this clutch here is, so that one's just way gone. Not, that's not even worth talking about, right? So this one here, I dropped her. I dropped the egg. Uh, she had it totally hidden and tucked in her tail. And I was in between uh, working the other business in here. So I kind of rushed it. And lo and behold, she had an egg and it dropped. So you could tell that it, it, doesn't, it doesn't feel right. And it doesn't look right. All right. So Father God, in the name of Jesus, we just thank you, Lord, for this uh, harvest. We just give you all the praise, all the honor, and all the glory. I just ask you to make this clutch just uh, good and surprising. And uh, we just thank you for the life and give it abundantly to us and the business. In Jesus' name, amen. All right. So I'll take these out here. I like to take this whole thing out. <clears throat> because we're going to put it right back in there. So we'll see if it proves. There's only going to be four chances. But you never know, right? I'm just going to open this one. I don't know if it feels all mushy. So I ended up incubating that rest of the way of that dropped egg just to make sure that no snake was going to come out of it and it did not. It failed, but God is good all the time. So here's what we're going for here. All right, let's see. I mean, we're on the 31st, so that's uh, four days early. Four days early. All right, we got a snake though. That's what's up. All right, that looks like a leopard. And that's gonna be het for VPI, 100%. And the pie, we don't know about the pie. So. That's cool though. All right, we got some snakes. We're in the business here. All right, snake number two. Let's see some VPI action here. Another head. But it's a leopard, I can live with that. I can live with that. All right. Nice and healthy babies. That's the most important thing. Thank you, Jesus. What we got? Another head. And it's another leopard. That's not bad though. Getting the leopards is not bad. All right. Come on, magic egg. Come on, magic egg. <laughs> All right, here we go. Another leopard. 
How crazy. And it's a hit. So, I'm pretty sure that she's not hit the PI, but then again, there was only four eggs to really have a, a good calculated answer on if she's a uh, head for VPI. I could live with that. Four leopards. You know, overall, so far, thus, this season, I maybe only had like maybe, I'm going to guess like maybe five normals. And everything else has been like uh, codoms and, and a lot of heads. Uh, even the heads, I only have like a handful of uh, normal so god's been blessing me grabbing on to his hand and i'll see you guys on the next video matter of fact this is i said this was clutch uh 16 uh and we just had another clutch uh hatch this morning not hatch uh, lay this morning so my albino trick uh she slugged out last year and this year she gave me five healthy ones and i just put them in the uh, incubator this morning so that, that, that's clutch 18. So we're getting close to 20. I still have like maybe two, one, more, one for sure that's pregnant. Uh, one is on its way to getting uh, for sure eggs and I'm still breeding like three other ones. So we're moving steady and it's the end of August, August 31st and we'll, we're, we're almost gonna be breeding year round this year. So that, that's, uh, that's tight. Y'all make some more space. See you later. What's up, y'all? Robbie C is the place to be. Just trying to just uh, do my Slither City snake update. So uh, this was from Clutch uh, 16. Um, and I'm, I'm actually going to combine it with the video so you guys have one view of it. This is a little update on them. So we have four survivors out of the six eggs. And this is what we got here. This one's a male. And I'm calling him a, a vanilla, or actually he might just be a leopard and inchy. So the pairing was that uh, possible head, exantic leopard, and then I bred her to my vanilla inchy, exantic. So this is the boy. He might be inchy and leopard for sure. That's one, 100% head for Exantic. And then this one is also a boy. This one is, I believe, everything. So he is a vanilla, leopard, enchi, head for Exantic. So I'm gonna compare him to the other ones. So if you see how creamy, he is, he has got that light head from the vanilla and uh, the leopard and the inchy kind of just make a really good looking snake. I mean, look at the tail, there's the sides here. Really nice coloring on him. This one's a female. So I think she is a, a leopard head exantic. I don't think there's anything else in there. I could be wrong, but I think she's a leopard for sure. That's my little update on her. And then the last one is a boy. So I hit three boys and one girl. Boo hoo. This one, the enchi and a vanilla. It's a vanilla enchi. So, now remember, I was saying that this one has everything. So you see how much more creamier he is than all the rest of them. And the pattern spaced out from the leopard a little darker, and then the inchy kind of breaks up the leopard. And you got that light head, just like this one. So that's the vanilla. Because this one here, let me just stay right here. This one here looks like this one, but just darker, so there's nothing else in there. The head has just a dark head, not much really uh, lightning on that. Stay right there. Okay? Mm -hmm. 
And then we have this one here. So this one's lighter than this one. So that's why I'm saying this one has Enchi and Leopard, and this one is just Leopard. And that's all, and you see right here, this one it has everything. It's just, just a little bit more smoother. The contrast kind of like goes together. So he is the winner of the clutch. And he'll, I'll probably, I'm gonna keep him and I'm gonna breed him to a, a spot nose leopard a visual example and we should get some pretty good babies from that. So that's him. This is the other boy that looks really cool. He'll probably, he will be for sale. They're all eating, they're eat, already eating rat pups. This is the leopard Enchi. This is the leopard. The only female, I'll probably, I'm gonna sell her, I have to. <laughs> I can't keep them all. And this is the leopard Enchi. So that's my update, all right? Peace.